The real question is, can Arthur Smith, the madman, take them there, okay? We know Smith got this job by leading a top 10 offense in Tennessee. We know more about Smith than we do about Ritter, so let's focus on that instead, okay? It was a team that made an AFC championship game with Ryan Tannehill at quarterback, led by a star running back, what do you know, and Derrick Henry and a top-tier wide receiver in A.J. Brown. So while they still have a little something to prove on the field, I do think this trio of Bijan Robinson, of Kyle Pitts at Drake London might be I mean, who's a more athletic trio in the NFL, okay? It's one of the, I mean, I put them up there, okay? The defense is upgraded. They stole Jesse Bates from the Bengals. I hated to see that. They have a veteran in Calais Campbell. They have Bud Dupree. So what do you really need out of Ritter, okay? What, what can Arthur, Arthur Smith get out of him? That's more of the question. If Ritter can be, I'm going to say like a, a floor Ryan Tannehill-esque steady hand at quarterback, you can't tell me the Falcons won't be a factor in the division race this year. It's up for grabs. And speaking of Atlanta, by the way, and you guys can give me your thoughts on Bijan, on Pitts, on what you're hearing maybe locally there about Desmond Ritter. But I do think it's going to be as the preseason rolls on and people start making their picks for division winners. Outside of the NFC West, where definitely the upset pick will be the Steelers over the Niners. It'll be like the easy, I'm so risky, but not really that much at all. Uh, it will be this division being taken by the Falcons. I can see it happening. Revamp defense, all of that. Hey, thanks for watching. Subscribe here to get the latest Up and Adams content right on YouTube.